In today's video, the new Trader Van came out, and it was the mythical weapon Trader Van. So you already know me. I got all my gems together, and I went and bought the mythical prototype. So if you guys do enjoy today's video, leave a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and yeah. Um, so the mythical prototype is, of course, mythical. It has an efficiency of 423, fire rate of 63, capacity of 8, and a mobility of 50. It has single shots, wall break, and forex zoom, which is awesome for the prototype. Which the prototype has all this stuff regularly, but when you get it at a mythical value, the efficiency goes up so much higher, and it does so much more damage. So like we do around here in our reviews, we're going to do two matches. We're going to do one on a team fight and one on a death match, and then I'll give you guys a rating for this weapon. So let's go get, let's waste no time, and let's go do it. We're going to start with our death match. We're going to go to, I don't know. Let's go for, where is, Cam did they remove Camelot? They oh, they did. They, they removed Camelot. Are you kidding me? So we'll go for Classic Pool because it's a classic weapon. And I hope it plays good. But they removed new Camelot. I can't believe that. Okay, Camelot's a good map though. So let's try it out. Let's um hit this kid. No, we didn't get him. But um I bet it's a one shot. Oh, looks like we got a three-category spammer. That must suck because I can't kill anybody now. Oh, dang. <laughs> I'm not even blaming the weapon. I'm actually kind of mad at this kid up there. But, hey, it's fine. It's fine. We'll just get her kills and get the weapon review done. I think this will do better on the team fight because um, this weapon is not really that good used alone. Especially when you have a player like um, that in the game. So, yeah, I guess we'll just kill these kids and see how it does. So, the weapon is playing decent. I only have, like, one kill with it. But, honestly, I don't blame the weapon for that. It's that guy right there, the red guy. He's just spamming the Chris's ultimatum. Also, guys, that gives me a kind of idea. Should I do a video on the top five most spammiest weapons of pixel gun put it in the comments if you guys have a idea if it is that go for it if it isn't go for that but also one thing i noticed about the weapon for the new skin for this weapon is it looks like the prototype got like struck by lightning kind of like in the thumbnail got struck by like purple lightning like doesn't it kind of guys i think it does what do you guys think tell me in the comments but i think it looks like lightning like struck the prototype and made it like super overpowered I mean, the prototype was always a really powerful weapon, but now it's at, like, its peak performance. Also, I, I would have done the entire trader van, but I don't have enough gems to do that. So if you guys could subscribe, I'd be able to buy more gems and make these reviews a little bit better and get more higher audio quality and everything like that. So please. Also, thank you guys so much for 100 subscribers. I hope you guys enjoyed my special with Fluffy, and I hope you guys enjoyed the comedy in that video. And if you guys want more of those videos just in general, like the more real life funny little skits like that, um, tell me because I'm down to always make them. They're not hard to make. And I mean, yeah, because I had a lot of fun doing that. We, um, me and Fluffy did that. I'm still wondering how Fluffy got to my house, though. Like, I don't even like, I don't sure how he got to my house, but I think it was kind of fun. So the prototype, right? It was a weapon that was added in like the earlier times of the game. It's not a new weapon. It's just this new mythical trader van brought it back as, like, a mythical weapon, which is... Like, I've always had the prototype. Like, when I bought this, it was cheaper because I'd already owned the weapon. So it was going to be cheaper for me since I already had it. And I wasn't buying the weapon. I was just buying the mythical status for it and the cool new skin that came with it. So, yeah. And also, if you guys want um, more um, trader van reviews, set reviews, please tell me. Because I'm always looking for ideas. If you give me an idea, you get credit for it. I always give credit where credit is due. If you look in the description of some of my videos, like my guide for beginners, I gave credit to the person who um, helped me with that, the Dark Web Girl. Also, go check out the Dark Web Girl's channel. She, upload, she uploaded a video explaining the clans, which is it's a really good video. I watched all the way through it. I left a like on it. I commented on it. And, um, yeah, please go check that video out. It explains everything about the clans if you were wondering. Because I know some people don't know how they work, and it's a very descriptive video that I think deserves more support than it has. So please go check it out. I'll put her name in the description. I'll also put um, B Worm's channel and Diamond Fox's channel because I heard Diamond Fox is going to upload today. 
Maybe. Because, you know, Diamond Fox has told me this all the time. But we got 14 kills that game. Which, that is awesome for a sniper alone. I think this sniper can really compare to the Succubus, honestly. So, yeah, now we're going to go into a random map. So, we got Paradise Resort. And um, we'll see how this plays in a team fight now. Which, we got the perfect sniper camping spot. But I don't snipe camp. If I'm going to use a sniper, I'm going to run in quick. Like that. See that? Never hide with a sniper because you will be the first person dead. But yeah, this weapon is actually really good. It's better than I thought it would be, being as though it is, although it is the prototype. So the prototype has always really been a good weapon, but you know they've really made it better with this whole new trader van, and I really like that. You know what I mean? I think it's a lot better now, especially, and it's really cheap. It's cheaper than buying the regular ultimatum because the ultimatum cost me a thousand gems. This one cost me like eight hundred gems. So it was cheaper than the ultimatum, which was. The Ultimatum was expensive, but it's worth it. And if you want to check out the Ultimatum, go check out my um, Ultimatum review I uploaded a while ago. It was one of my first reviews I ever did. So yeah, go check that out if you want to question about the Ultimatum. Also, um, I might do a Proton Freezer review. The reason I haven't is because I did the Primal Beast versus Proton Freezer, which is kind of just the Proton Freezer review mixed with a Primal Beast review. So I don't think I really need to do that. But, um, I could if you guys want me to. Also, we got our second video on the channel to a thousand views, which is awesome. We got the Succubus review hit a thousand views along with the Gold Division review. So those two videos are my most popular videos. And it's awesome seeing that you guys support the channel that much to give me thousands of views, which is amazing. And I'm thankful for all of you guys, and I hope you guys are all doing good during this time and everything that's going on around the world. I hope you guys are all safe and not sick. Hope you guys are all doing well. Um, I am. There's nothing around my area. There's nothing. There's no. There's not a lot of cases around me, so everything around me is fine. I just hope everything's good around you guys. But honestly, the prototype it does have the zoom, but remember, I don't ever use the zoom, so. I want to get, like, a full-on, like, using my own aim with this weapon because if you guys don't know, I have a decently good accuracy when shooting snipers because um, I use one of the snipers in the game. It's a single shot. It has no extra power-ups. I use the um, heavy sniper rifle. I like the heavy sniper rifle because it's good for practicing your aim and your accuracy, but the prototype is also really good for that, too, because it only has wall break. But, yeah, so that's the mythical prototype, the new mythical prototype. It's awesome. We got 11 kills with just a sniper alone. And, yeah, so I like the weapon. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 because I would definitely spend your gems on it. And I think it is definitely one of the best in this entire thing since Rocket Jumping got nerfed. And it's probably better than the Rocket Jumper. So, yeah, I want to thank you guys all for watching this video. And, um, there's my ID. Come and friend me. I usually accept. Um, there's a clan ID in the bottom left there. And, yeah. And I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for 100 subscribers. And, yeah. I will see you guys later. Goodbye.